Welcome to the channel. Today we are going to see class 11 NCRT chapter number 8 binomial theorem exercise 8.1 using binomial theorem evaluate Roman number 9 99 whole power 5. Okay. Using binomial theorem na, definitely we need uh, what is that a plus b whole power n or a minus b whole power n. This format we need then only it is uh, able to use uh, binomial theorem. So that the given question please we can change in the form of uh, in this any one. So that the 100, what is that, this 99, I am going to write 100 minus 1 whole power 5. Now this is in the form of a minus b whole power n. Then we have the formula, what is that, uh, a minus b whole power n in the sense, we have that what, uh, n c naught a power n minus n c 1 a power n minus 1 b plus n c 2 a power n minus 2 b square and up to plus minus 1 whole power n n c n b power n understand now this formula we have to use here okay now here the value of a value of a is 100 and value of b is 1 okay now we will start to substitute here then you will be will get the answer okay now see this so 100 minus 1 whole power 5 in the sense so 5 in the sense that is n value so n is equal to 5 5 is equal to n so 5 c naught a power n in the sense uh, what is that 100 power 5 minus 5 c 1 100 power 5 minus 1 in the sense 4 into b value 1 plus 5c2 a value 100 5 minus 2 na 3 and b value 1 square okay minus 5c3 and a value 100 5 minus 3 na 2 into and b value 1 power 3 you will get plus 5c4 a value 100 5 minus 4 na power 1 and b value 1 whole power 4 and minus 5c5 b value 1 whole power 5 that's it now if you simplify this you will get the answer now we'll start to do this 5c naught when you're getting naught it is equal to 1 simply so 100 power 5 we have Later I will write this. 5C1. First time I am simplifying the C everything. 5C1 na, that is also 5. Now 100 power 4 we have. And 5C2 in the sense that is 10 already we did. If you need na, I will show here. So 5C2 in the sense by using this NCR formula. N factorial divide R factorial into N minus R factorial. Now 5c2 in the sense 5 factorial whole divided 2 factorial into 5 minus 2 na 3 factorial. Then 5 factorial we can able to write like this 2 factorial 2 into 1 3 factorial 3 to 1 like this. So this 3 to 1 3 to 1 cancelled. So 1 2 are 2 2 are 4. Now 5 2 are 10. So 10 is the value of 5c2. Okay. So that the 5c2 I am substituting 10 into 100 power 3 1 power 2 leave it likewise minus 5c3 5c3 also 10 so what i said here the same format you have to use it you will get 10 only into 100 square plus 5c4 5c4 let i show you 5c4 in the sense you will get here 5 factorial whole divide 4 factorial into 5 minus 4 na 1 factorial so 5 factorial na 5 4 3 2 1 whole divide 4 factorial in the sense 4 3 2 1 into 1 factorial na 1 so this fully will cancel then remaining we have 5 so that here you will get 5 understand so 100 power 1 in the sense 100 only 1 power 4 leave it no problem so minus 5 c5 now both are same so that you will get 1 only 
1 power 5 na and also 1 so 1 into 1 1 so minus 1 finally we have here understand now if you apply the power you will get the answer now 100 power 5 in the sense this double zero we have to write 5 time so 1 5 what is that double zero you need to write 5 time so 1 pair second pair third pair fourth pair and this is fifth pair like that okay now 5 we have then 1 into 5 now 5 only will get so this double zero you have to write 4 times so 1 pair 2 third pair and this is fourth pair understand now we have already here 10 so 10 you can write so this double zero we need to write 3 times so 1 pair second pair third pair understand likewise here also we have 10 10 i'm writing first this 100 you have to write two time means a double pair one second pair that's it 5 into 100 500 minus 1 we have now plus value and minus value we have to add now listen this carefully and this is positive and this is positive and 500 this three value if we add this together you will get 1 0 0 1 4 times 0 5 double 0 okay this 5 double 0 i was written here and this things will come here because double digit we have extra so that i am giving a double 0 that's it likewise this three value you need to add understand then what you will get minus 5 compared to this we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 1 2 3 4 5 6 now we have 3 digit then 5 double 0 you can give remaining fully 0 that's it and here we have 1 so 1 fully 0 you can give finally 1 1 that's it understand so 0 0 0 0 finally 1 1 that's it now if we subtract this you will get the answer that's it understand now we will start to subtract this so 0 minus 1 means we have to borrow here this is 4 9 10 no? 10 minus 1 no? we are getting 9 okay now 9 minus 0 9 you will get again we have 4 4 minus 0 4 you will get again this is up to 1 2 3 4 digit we have 0 only so that but we have a double digit with 0 after that we have 1 so double 0 you can give for this 1 no? just subtract okay just borrow this you will get here 99 then uh, what is that 10 minus 1 no? we are getting 9 so 99 in the sense another 9 you will get after borrowed then 10 is there okay then we have here 100 100 minus 5 no? that is 95 that's it so i hope you will understand this thank you thanks for watching this video subscribe for getting more videos and press the bell icon for getting notification